got a dog, baby, I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she, anything. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 Let's Play. So, this episode is going to be a little bit different. I, um, this is going to be the first settlement builder episode. Let's get away from this cow. So, this is what I'm thinking of doing. Um, I'm thinking that probably not everybody wants to watch settlement building. But I would like to do some of it in my Let's Play. And I was toying with the idea of either like doing it behind the scenes, like between episodes, and then just show you guys what I built. But then I know a lot of you probably would like to see me actually building these things. So I thought I would do sort of a compromise kind of thing, where I would record the whole thing as an episode, and then have it but have it a separate, sort of like its own separate series, but sort of connected to this one. So on the days when I have a settlement building episode to be released, I will also still be releasing the same amount of regular Let's Play episodes. So I basically be posting, I'll be releasing an actual extra episode that will be the settlement builder. And then you can watch it or not, whatever you want. And then my next episode of the Let's Play will pick up where the previous episode of the Let's Play left off. So, for instance, my previous episode, the one right before this one, left off with um, Shane telling Preston that it's time to retake the castle, right? So... In this episode right now, I'm not going to be leaving and going to do that. I'm going to stay here and build stuff. I'm going to build a gatehouse for over by the bridge. That's what I think I'm going to do. Build a little bit more um, security here. Now, the next episode after this one that I'll be posting will be a continuation of the main uh, story in which Shane will go on his way to the castle. So, if you don't want to watch Settlement Building, skip this one. You won't miss any of the story at all. Alright? I hope that wasn't too confusing for all of you guys. Um, if you need clarification, just say so in the comments and I'll try to answer as best I can. Anyway, so, now that that's out of the way, I will um, get to it. Let's go down to the uh, the bridge. Now, in case you're wondering, so Nick, if you remember in the previous uh, the episode right before, he wanted to talk about something. But I didn't want to talk to him with his helmet on. Um, I took his helmet off, but <laughs> he doesn't have a hat now. Uh, anyway... So I'm going to talk to him after I'm done building the gay house. So in the next um, main story episode. So that the people who skip this one won't miss my conversation with Nick. Anywho. Alright, so now that we're down here. I want to fortify Sanctuary. I've been putting it off a little bit too long, I think. There's really hardly any fortifications here. So, uh, it's like, what, I have three turrets in this entire settlement. <laughs> That's not a lot. So I'm going to build a gatehouse right here, and then I'm going to start building a wall. I don't know if I'll actually build the wall in this episode, but I'm going to start with the gatehouse at least, and I'm going to scrap the stuff here. Put this in the way. So... Let's just kind of clear this area up a little bit. Uh, move that tree too, I think. And I'm going to move these out of the way for now. Because... Yeah, they're going to get in the way. And this little spindly thing right here, I don't need that. Or that one. Okay. 
so let's see I had an idea for this already so I'm going to start with what I have the idea for what I want to do is build a um, not just a gate with guard towers like on either side but I want to build like a gate that has a gate house above it where the guards can stand over the gate and look out across the bridge because if you're down here you can't really see over the bridge you can't see who's coming until they're in the middle of the bridge so I want my guards to be up high where they can see what's coming so let me see here I think I would like to have here, let me let me just see how wide the gate is. Um, gates, where's 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 gates? Gates, gates, gates. Fences. There we go. So this gate, I want this gate to be. I don't know, somewhere around here. Um, I don't know. I'm not sure where. Right here. Okay, so it's about as wide as the, the road. Alright, well, let's make the gatehouse first and put the gate in later. So I'm going to make these. And I'm thinking... Well, those can clip into that pretty well. Huh. Um, well, let's see here. Let's put this up as high as it can go. Uh, I can maybe reposition it later. Oh, so that's actually floating a little bit. Whoops. Alright, let's put that down a little bit. I don't know if that's tall enough. Alright. Now, to make it a good... I think... That the... Uh, Gotta be facing the same direction they do. Okay. And then put one of these on this side. If it will go, I want to go. It doesn't want to attach. Why not? There goes it. No, it did it. There it goes. Okay. There. So that's a little too low. Is that too low? Yes, it is. So you know what? I'm going to... Okay, I use those to space them. But I think I'm going to put... a diff another, another level. Because... That's just going to be easier that way. To walk underneath. Alright. Now, don't worry about that. I know it looks kind of funny. I have an idea. <laughs> I have an idea to make it not look funny anymore. First, I'm going to fill this back in. Ah, get up there. Wait. Those aren't facing the right way. There we go. That's better. Now my gate will fit right here and it won't clip through the top. And so then we'll put the, the gatehouse up there. But first... We'll go back to fences. Wait. I am going to... Put... Uh, I'm going to put some of these down to kind of hide the... Uh, this to hide this funny looking <laughs> thing here um, so let's just make a few let's make a few I think I need four here um, I'm gonna make two I'm gonna make two without I, I, I know there it is. I'm gonna make two without barbed wire and two with barbed wire. I think. Put the barbed wire ones on the outside. Okay, and now we're gonna do 
is a wonderful rug glitch to get these things. Uh, let's see, I guess you could just use this one. To get these things fitting right. So, go. I think I need to have this be pretty long to reach through. Maybe not quite that long, but the longer the better. Alright, let's do the outside one first. So for the outside one, I'm going to want to reach through this way. Oh, the weather's going to turn on me. And, oops, and then I'm going to... There we go. Love the rug glitch. Alright, so let's stick this in here like this. Maybe. Check it. Make sure it's good. I can't see it. It looks good. So sort of like a, just a, a fortification. They protect the guard tower. And then I'll put another one on this side. So it's kind of like a... Yeah. Alright. I'll use this again. I'm just going to check it again. Since it sunk a little bit, I want to make sure it's still good. Looks good. You know what, guys? I'm going to go um, wait out this rain and uh, come back to this in a moment. So, be right back. Alright, we are back. So, it's actually the next day. Um, because it was already like 6.30 in the evening and uh, I thought, well, I might as well sleep and start over fresh in the morning. It's actually not morning, it's noon because it was still raining when I got up. So, anywho, here we are. What was I doing? Right. Other side. Okay. So. Uh, get the other rug up there. <clears throat> so I use the big rugs <coughs> excuse me for these things because the big rugs are they're easier to place these giant things on. Now I probably don't need this many little rugs for this side because I'm not reaching through. Actually probably actually don't need, shouldn't use that many because then I can't sink it down as low as little slope here. All right, let's get that in there. Let's see. Try that. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Oh, that one. Yeah, I guess it doesn't look too bad. This side's nice though. Alright, I think that'll do. There! And I'll do the other side too. That way. I don't know if that'll work. Let me check that. Oh. I need to put it up on a, a ledge. The... The bottom rug needs to be higher up than this rug would be sitting on the ground or they won't connect, so it's nice to have them go out on a like go out over a ledge or off a slope or something. Okay. Alright, let's put this one in here. <clears throat> this way. 
leave. This is hard to do with that sign there. The reason why I'm not doing it this way is because I want the barbed wire on the outside of the the gate. So the same as on that side. So it's hard to see though. Okay, well let's just kind of Actually, you know what? I think I need to do I need to curve the uh Let's see. Curve it. It's going like this. That'll make it easier <clears throat> to see what I'm doing. Hopefully. Alright. That might make it better. Because these rugs keep wanting to clip into this sign. Hard to tell. Hard to tell how this is working. Just put it down and see what I need to do. I need to push it forward. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm clipping into this. Oh, I can't put it under that sign? That's odd. Ah! My rugs aren't long enough. I can't... Mm. I need to add some rugs. Hold on a second. Let's see. need to add a few. <laughs> this is a little bit crazy. Okay. There, now I can do it. Alright. Get that in there. Oh, come on. Okay, come on. Did that work? Did it work? Did it work? Is it good? It's a little bit farther out than I'd like it to be. Alright. move it in a little bit. That looks good there. Oh, I think that's good enough. I think that is just fine. Alright. Let's take my rugs. My massive chain of rugs. I don't think I'll need all of these for the next one. So, let's see. I'm gonna put these ones over here. I like just setting them aside rather than putting them back in the build menu. And I don't think that's gonna connect. Nope. Alright. And the last one. Okay, here we go. Oh, actually, maybe I didn't need all those rugs after all. At least a couple more. Because I still have to reach through the sign a little bit. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I can get it. It's just hard to see what I'm doing. <laughs> no, I need a couple more rugs. I do. Just a couple more. That's good enough. I think it looks good. Okay. Alright. Stick these over here. With the others. 
Oops. Not into the ground. There we go. All right, so here's the beginnings of our watchtower, our gatehouse, whatever. Yeah, that's kind of nice. So then we can put the gate in. Oh, here, let's get the rug back out first before we move. Because I'm going to be putting... I'm going to be using the rug glitch to put the gate in. Um, no wait. Fences, there we go. <laughs> keep forgetting where these things are sometimes. Alright, so I'm gonna be putting the gate right here. Except I need to use the rug glitch to do it, so. Just like that. Okay. So, let's get some rugs. Probably don't need very many. Now, it looks like it's just floating there, like my rug will just slide out from underneath it when I pick it up, but it won't. You can see it, it pop up onto it, onto the rug. When you see that little pop, boom, I made a video about this, one of my tips and tricks videos. That shows you that it's actually connecting to the rug, so when you select it, it actually will pick, pick the fence up. All right, so let me see. Should I have it in the middle or all the way out to the edge? I'm... Let's just test it and see. So get it centered. Let's try that. Let's try that. You can see it from both sides. I kind of like it being slightly recessed into it, though. I do. Yeah. That's nice. Okay. It, is it crooked? Nah. Oops. Yeah. Okay. Now it's time to build the actual house part. So let's get a ladder to get us up there. Um, let's do one of these for now. I'm probably going to add a different ladder later because uh, this is just to get us up there. Alright, so for this, what I'd like to do, perhaps, oh, I turned those, ar I remember turning those around, but I actually turned them the wrong way. They must look different underneath. I have to have all the boards facing the same direction. I just do. So, from up here, they can see enemies coming from all the way over there. So, this would be a much better place to have guard towers. Oh wait, so let's see. I'm going to use not these. I'm not going to use those. I'm going to use these. And I'm going to put um, I'm going to put one right here. That's not perfect. Uh, let's see how that works. And I'm going to put that right there. So this will be... That's not going to snap. Of course it's not going to snap. Yeah, it'll snap if I put... <laughs> Whatever. Whatever it wants me to do one side at a time, we'll do one side at a time. No snappy snap? There you go. Alright, now the other side. 
finicky little things. There. Alright, so this will be the guard house. And I'm going to put guard posts up here. So I think I'm going to do <clears throat> two guard posts up here. Just these kind. And I will put them up one back here. And the right. Okay. Let's make it straight. Now, I know I can get it in there. I've done it before. Just a little bit. That might be good enough. Doesn't have to be all the way in. Because I don't want the barbed wire to be sticking out. The front. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. I could use the rug glitch to get it in there. But I don't think I really actually need to. And now a second one. Actually, let's come in this way. This one's going in a lot nicer. This is what I remember them doing. Why wouldn't the first one do that? See, th I can push this one in all the way in. And then the barbed wire will be sticking out a little bit. But, I don't know, maybe that doesn't really matter. I wonder if I can try to get, <clears throat> try to get it in a little bit better. I don't know why it's not working on this side. Or will it? Ah! Look at that! It is! It did it! Nice! Alright, guard tower. Two guard posts. I'm going to put a little bit of like stuff there for them. But I am now going to build a railing here so that we don't fall off. Um, oh, railings are in here. So I'm just going to put a bit of a railing here. And let me see. I'll have... I need a stair coming off of this. I don't actually like using these kinds. I like using the other straight stair and adding my own top thingy to it because they're just a little bit more flexible I think to use I like this now down here oh let me fix that if you see <laughs> sometimes when you clip items into other items they vibrate a little bit they're textures collide and um, just select it and then cancel and it should reset it. This one's doing it too. It's always a good idea just to go around and do it anyway just out of habit I guess. Sometimes I forget to do it though. Even if they're not doing it they might start doing it later. Okay so now for this upper part, let's see. It's starting to look kind of cool. So let's do. Hmm. I want the stair to go sideways, I think. I leveled. I'm going to wait and actually pick a perk um, in the actual let's play. So the people who skip this building episode won't miss my perk choices. The, what I chose for perk. <laughs> yeah, so anyway. <laughs> Alright. That's good. That's good. Actually, you know what?
I don't need this. Let's put it right here. That way I don't have to have that extra little thing bopping out on the side. Though now the stairs will go out into the road. I suppose that doesn't really matter, or I could have them come off this side. Come on. Yeah, I'll have them come off that side, and then I'm going to put one of these underneath for support. Because I can't stand floating things. I just, I cannot stand floating things. So it's just a sort of a, a suggestion of support. It's not like super. Yeah. Maybe I'll put a turret right there to protect the gate. So if anyone makes it through the gate, um, they'll get shot by this thing. <laughs> There. There we go. And one more railing on the side here. There. Ha ha! Is it already getting dark? Ugh. Alright, now the uh, the guards need something. The guards need a place to take their breaks, I think. I like to put creature comforts for the the settlers. Let's see, they need a little table. Maybe this one. Yeah, there's not enough room in here. Get it in here. Where'd it go? Okay. Sometimes they like to throw they like to go up over my head. Okay, let's let's use the round one actually. It might fit better. Right here. Ah. And now we need a chair. Chairs. What kind of chair would they have up here? Probably a folding chair. Come on, get in here. Get in here and just, just ah, okay. There now I can get closer. Put the table back a little further and there. And they need a radio. They definitely need a radio because this can be a pretty boring place without a radio. And we'll just put it right on the table. So this is like when they uh, take their breaks, they'll they'll take them right here. Oh, now we need lights. Definitely need lights. So, um, what kind of lights should we use? We got these. Um. All kinds of lights. These ones don't really kind of suit the place, though. Blah. Um. Yeah, you know what? Actually, if we use lanterns, I wouldn't have to wire it up, would I? Where'd the lanterns go? Are lanterns under lighting? I don't think they are. What are they under now? They're under... Are they under decor? They are. Okay. We could use lanterns instead and then... And then I wouldn't have to wire the place up. But then it won't be as neat. Hmm. Yeah, let's just wire it. Might as well. Oops. Um, what am I doing? <laughs> I lost where I was. Okay, lights. Let's just do the regular industrial um, things. These ones. 
So, and I'll put one right there. And I'll put one on this end. And maybe I'll put one on each side of these. That should take care of the inside. And now I'm going to want to do some lights on the outside too. So let's see. Like I'm going to want to light up the front of it. But how? In what way? Let's close the gate to see what this looks like. Oh yeah, look at that. That's cool. I think it looks cool. Alright. Um, maybe... What is this? That looks like something that you'd stick on the front of a gate. Isn't it? Eh, maybe we can have a couple of those gate lights. And then, maybe just for fun, up at the top, we can have some of these hanging hanging down. I love these things. I'm so glad they added these to the game. Just a few going across the top for so that it looks a little bit more inviting. Well, that's really up high. I feel like I'm sunk down. I guess I am. There's like a, a little dip here. Hmm. What if I could put a I could put a floor like a like coming off of the bridge. Just a thought. I probably this hmm. Maybe I can do a bunch of these little ones. Just to make it different. Does that will not go in there. Cool snort. And that won't go down either. Oh yeah it will. It will! I saw it! There you go. Come on. No? Oh. Fine. And that won't go down right there either. It's starting to get dark and it's hard to see what I'm doing. Anyway, I kind of leveled the ground out a little bit. Kind of looks cool and scrappy. There, and so now when I walk up to the gate it doesn't feel so tall. Puddle control. A, bi a big puddle would... <laughs> uh oh. Uh, floating lights. Can't have that. There we go. Alright, now we need to power this thing up. So, where should we put a generator? Because I don't actually have a generator. Like, a dedicated generator building yet. So, for now, I think I'm not going to have one either. That'll have to be for a, oops, a different episode. Building a generator room. Generator house. So for now I'm just going to stick a... A generator right here. And I am definitely... Making that quieter. Because ugh, I hate the sound of the generators. Alright, so let's wire this up. Let's put... Conduit... Um, I don't have any ceramic. I have I have enough to make one of these. That's super frustrating. Oh wait. Are there any bathrooms I can scrap? 
All right, I scrapped a few toilets and sinks, so that should be good enough. Now let's put a conduit right here. And one right here, that should work. And then we will let's stick this back here. And boom. Oh, I don't even actually and yes I do need it. Okay. The one light on the far end isn't lit yet. Come on. Ah. There we go. Alright, let's go out here and see what this looks like with the gate closed. Cool. That's kind of cool. And then so, I'm going to also build a wall out from there on each side. And I haven't decided what kind of wall I want to build yet. I kind of want it to be... A concrete wall or maybe a mixture of concrete and wood I like the scrappy look like they collected scrap wood and stuff but I don't like junk fences just by themselves I just think they're not quite enough especially with a gatehouse like this where you just need a little bit something a little bit more I think There, now we just need settlers to assign to these guard posts. Oh, you know what? June. June can be the guard for this place. He's not doing anything useful. And maybe that can get him out of the way. Hee hee! Get his moping self doing something. He's probably in bed. No? What time is it? 11.20. No, he wouldn't be in bed yet. So let's go find him. June! Yeah. There you are. I have a job for you. Come here. Let's go. I'll show you the ropes. You'll have a crash course in... Uh, <laughs> crash course in guard duty. I need to put some lights on this side of it. Alright. There we go. Now assigned. Now he will be forever standing up there not griping at me about anything. Okay. Lights on this side. Let's put some more of these ones here. I think those look good as gate lights. One on each side. Is it just me or is one higher up than the other? Yeah, that's fine. There. I like it. Oh, you know what? I think I'm going to put a few more of the drapey lights on this end because it's just in, it's just a little bit too dark for my taste. I like lots of light in my settlements, so there's gonna be a lot of light. And one more. That's better! better. Okay. I like it. Fun gatehouse. Now, you know what? Actually, we need turrets. We need more turrets. I wonder if I can build more. No, because I just ran out of copper. And you need copper to build turrets, right? Don't you? No, you don't. Oh, but I still don't have oil. To build the nice ones. Hmm. Um, well, I have this one. And I need to put it somewhere. I was, actually, I wonder... If 
it's possible for me to put it... I could put it back where it was, but I wonder if I could put it up here. Ooh, I almost could. I don't know if it can actually shoot out of there, though. It might hit the side of the thing. Although, I wonder if I could... Um, I need a ladder. Where are the ladders? I need some stairs so I can get up high and see down in there. If I, um, built up... If I built it up so that they could actually... Let's stick a, a stair. I feel like I'm gonna fall off here. This might not go. Oh, yeah, no, it will, it will, it will. So let's see if this will work. If I can get that to snap in. Got it. Get it in there. Nope. It's too big. So, move it back a little bit. This might not work. I'm just testing it. Ah, now the thing got stuck. Okay. As pro. What happened? What just happened? Okay. I accidentally picked it back up again. This is probably not going to work. I'm probably just wasting my time with this. Move. There we go. Okay. Oh! No, wait! wait. Ah! <laughs> it did! It worked! I could even do that. Nah. Alright, so then... I have a turret out already, but... If I... If this works, I'm going to put one on each side, so... I'll build another one anyway. That's better. Look at this. Now, the thing is, if... Oops. <laughs> Carla's Brahmin just caught up with her finally. Now, if something came, like, right up to the gate, and, like, was right here, then it wouldn't be able to shoot but if something came right up to the gate and was this close to the gate, they'd already be inside anyway, and then it would be this one that would be shooting, and probably maybe I can put some more on the inside too. But this one would be able to shoot the things that are crossing the bridge, so I like that. I like where it's located, so I'm going to do the other side. Hopefully the other side works. Sometimes uh, things while they might look the same on both sides at first glance, they are not at all the same. Okay, so let's see if we can get this down in here. Get it in there, come on. Alright, let's see if that worked good enough. Nope. I feel like I'm gonna fall off. And I did. Okay, that one is not going down. Let's try moving it over a little bit. It won't push out if there's a th something in Oh, there! It worked! It's just slightly in a different position. So let's get that... Whoa! What did I just do? <laughs> I just lost my sense of direction suddenly. That was weird. Okay. <clears throat> and... <sighs> Alright. 
and turret in. It's facing the wrong direction. Is that good? There we go. I think that's good. Nice. Nice. All right. I think that'll do it. I think that'll do it. For this build. So, what do you guys think? I like it. Yeah. All right. So, that's basically what these episodes are going to be like. I'm just going to... Whenever I'm in a settlement... Uh, whenever I end an episode in a settlement... I'll be having a let's build, probably. If I'm able to build something, I will have a let's build after that. So, that's I think that's how I'm going to do it from now on. Let me let me know what you guys think about this idea and this the, the way that I'm doing the, the episodes. If you like the idea of them being separated, or if you would rather just have them together. I don't. This took a whole length, the whole episode length to get this built. So. Yeah, and I know that everybody doesn't want to see settlement buildings, so... I just thought I would do it this way so you can skip them if you want to. Anyway, that is the end of this one, so I'll see you guys in the next story episode following this one, where, where we will go and begin our journey to the castle. Probably won't reach the castle because, you know, distractions. <laughs> anyway, see you guys later. Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she's anything but calm.